Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another video. No gameplay here, but I just wanted to show you a project that I've been working on recently. After I finally got some parts for it, I just decided to go ahead and proceed with it. And after a couple hours, after some research of tracing and everything, I think I was finally able to come up with something to help you um, MacDev owners, Tadao owners, and hopefully even um, other gun owners with Tadao boards. Um, as you may or may not know, uh, MacDev from the RX to the clones with their, with their screens had um, some problems with it dying or even go, uh, going dim o over some period of time. Um, that also happened with the Tadao boards. Um, it wasn't only just for the MacDev guns, but other users, for, you know, from autocockers to die, found that even though they haven't been re really using it too much, if they just put it in the in the closet for some time, maybe even using it just one time, and the after a couple of months or maybe even years of not using it, they they turn it on only to find that they're screen is is dim. Um, one thing that Tadao did was release a LED conversion board um, and you can see it right here. Now we were hoping that they were going to re-release it and have some more for people who have dim boards but as of right now they are not planning to make more. Actually, the website is is done, so I don't know what the future holds for Tadao. So um, recently, I got back into MacDev, and one of them basically had a dead board. Here is the board that I got from from Tadao, and you know, not only was it dim, but it already came loose. Um, so I was fortunate enough to finally find one with an LED board so I can take a look at it. Um, so after some researching and tracing, I finally um, was able to find some parts that I needed to try and, and do an experiment. And this is what I came up with. Um, as you can see right there, it's not too pretty as you can see, but it does the job. As you can hear, is another one. Um, like I said, I just actually just got these parts in today. As soon as I got home, I rushed to open it up and um, followed my schematics. And here is the second one that I that I made. Um, so now here we are with the batteries in the droids to show you the comparison in the programming mode, just so you can see the uh, the different colors. Um, let me see if I can even find a way. Ah, there we go. All right, so first let me turn on the LED conversion board. Hopefully the colors of the LEDs are going to show. I'm outside right now. So here we are. Let me see. Let's see if you can tell if it's red. Let's see if I can get... Okay. And here we go. So we have white, cyan, blinking green, pur blinking purple, blinking yellow, blinking blue, blinking red. So like I said, hopefully this video will encourage you guys out there with dead screens, whether it be MacDev, or you know, uh, autocockers or any gun with a Tadao. Um, now, even though you have a dead screen, hopefully you might know somebody who is familiar with soldering. Now, I'm no, I'm really no expert in soldering, so um, I do have a little bit of history uh, soldering. But basically, if you take your time and and make sure that everything is clean you should be able to do it as well. Um, so this is basically to give you guys some hope um, even though Tadao is not officially making these boards anymore. Um, whether you want to do it yourself or know somebody who knows about soldering and, and circuitry even more than I do, you can basically 
ask them for a favor and make yourself one. So basically uh, that's it. Any questions about the, this LED board? Feel free to let me know in the comments below or private message me. Um, I'm gonna continue and try to clean things up. I don't know um, if I'm going to reroute it, reroute the wires or do anything else with it. But right now as it stands, as you can see, it's pretty similar to the conversion board. So thank you again for watching this video and feel free to comment subscribe and like it. Thanks again.